So today is uh, late winter in Texas, probably early spring. It's only like January 6th, but uh, we are fishing with the deeper fish finder today. So the cool thing about this fish finder is you can just drop it in the water, send it to your smartphone, and it'll show you where the fish are. Now today we're fishing in a marina. Marina that me and Clark kind of cut our teeth on, but I've never made a video here before. And we're always dropping baits in the slips, in these slips here. We never know if there's fish there. And so a cool thing about the deeper is you can put the deeper in there and it'll tell you if there's fish. And as you can tell, this, fish. this screen is lighting up. Now those things at the bottom that say 47.7, 47.5, 0.6, 0.5, that's all one fish there. That's not, you know, 10 separate fish. But uh, it kind of gives you a, a clue as to where the fish are. And man, they're, they're really spread around the water column, as you can see. Hopefully, we can drop the baits down to them, see them on our graph, and end up catching those fish. Hold on, let's see. I mean, that's like, that's like the same one there. There's a fish at 23 feet. I'm gonna yeah. put it at roughly 23 feet. Professionally over -spooled. Oh, you gotta bite, you gotta bite. Uh, a little guy. There we go. I don't wanna kill him. Oh, he might be bigger than I thought. Ah, he's oh. in your line. He's in my line. So as you guys can tell, we saw the fish on the deeper fish finder. We dropped it 20, 23 feet exactly where it was, and Clark caught that fish. Good stuff. There he is. He hit me as soon as I. Oh, was... Clark got one. It was a little though. As soon as we were looking at the uh, at the fish on the fish finder, Clark got himself a fish on the deeper. All right, we've got something from Clark. What do you got to say about this thing? I'm not just actually promoting something. This thing actually works. It's weird. Now, one of the cool things about this fish finder is that, let's say you're fishing a marina and you're dropping down into these slips, or you're fishing in a pond or, or something where you don't have, you know, ability to have a fish finder on a real boat or something, you will save a lot of time by dropping this thing down there to see if there's fish down there. Because if you're dropping in a slip that doesn't have fish and you don't know it, you're just wasting a lot of fishing time. And so what's cool is you can just go, you know, slip by slip, dropping the deeper down there to see if there's fish and, uh, as you can tell, it works so far. Hey, Mr. Turtle, how are you doing today? All right, we dropped it down to about 47 feet and Clark got the fish. Look at that, folks. Catfish, I think. We saw the ah. fish on our, oh, to get off? Yep. Oh, it got off. But uh, we saw the fish right down there at 47 feet. It was kind of sitting there for a long time. And so we dropped right down there and caught it. Slime Almost caught it what depths exactly you need to be dropping your minnows or your swim baits or your grubs or whatever kind of technique you're gonna to use to catch these suspended fish in the winter. But uh, deeper, a must have for fishing uh, suspended fish when you don't have a boat. What is up y'all, I hope you enjoyed that video. You know, me and Clark have been fishing this marina since we were kids and I uh, never made a video on it, but I decided today I take the deeper fish finder and then try it out for the first time. Deeper sent it to me and said, hey, make a video on this. And uh, sorry it's been a long time, but finally got around to it. You know, perfect conditions where it's where it's cloudy and a little bit of rain, but not windy at all. And so you can drop your baits right down there with, with no interference. And uh, this thing works. Me and Clark are talking about it. We're not just endorsing something that, that, we, that doesn't work. This thing, you drop it down there and you can see those fish there and drop exactly to where they are. So uh, if you guys want to check out Deeper, the link will be in the description down below to go buy it. It's an awesome product. I definitely recommend it for wintertime fishing. Uh, want to check out my last video? Click up here. And if you guys haven't subscribed to my channel, do so. It's actually starting to rain right now, so uh, I'm going to stop this video right now. So thanks for watching. See you guys next time. <laughs> I touched him. You touched him. That was close enough. He picked his head up right as I was going for him. We don't share our fishing space with others.